Hello everyone, this is Mr. Botros Asad, and today we will talk about exploring uh, and solving number problems and puzzles like logic problems. Here I have a spaceship. It comes from planet Zeno, and it has some aliens, a number of aliens, some of them called pentapods and the other called pipods. The pentapods has, have five legs and the bipods have two legs. We counted the legs and we found that we have 17 legs all together. Now, I want to find out how many pentapods and how many bipods were there. How can I solve this problem? Should guessing be a good solution? Of course, no. What I will do, I will make a list of possible numbers, but which numbers? The multiples of five and the multiples of two. Why? Because the pentapods has five legs and bipods have two legs. So their legs should be a multiple of five and a multiple of two. When I add them, I get 17. So when I choose a number of this, from this list, multiples of two, and I add it to, this, uh, to a number from this list, a multiple of five, together will make 17. This will make my solution easier than guessing. So I will start by two. So two means one by bot. How many left if I, if I want to make 17? There are 15 left. 15 left means three pentabots. Two plus 15 equals 17. So here I have a correct solution. So the first solution is one pipot and three pentabot. This is the first solution. Okay, four, how many left? To make 17, I want 13. 13 is not here. What about 6? 11 left. 11 is not here. 8. I want 9. 9 is not here. 10. 10, I want 7. It is not here. 7 is not here. 12, I want 5. And 5 is here. So I have 12 legs and five legs. 12 legs means six bipods. Five legs means one pentabot. So the other solution here is six bipods and one pentabot. So until now, I have two solutions. Can I make more solutions? I think no, because if I go greater than 12, so this number will, I, I will get the other number smaller than five. And there is not a multiple of five is more smaller than five. So this, uh, these are the two possible solutions for this story. Now your homework to think if we have 27 legs or 30 legs, can you find the possible solutions? Yeah, make a list of multiples of two and multiples of five and start checking your choices. I have the same story, but in different way. This time the spaceship has tripods that have three legs and bipods that have two legs. When we counted the legs, we found 23 legs all together. 
So this time I will make a list of multiples of three and a list of multiples of two and start checking the possible answers. But there is an important note here. There were at least two of each of them. This means you can't choose a solution that has one tripod or one bipod. So the first multiple of two is not an option. And the first multiple of three is not an option because I have to have two of each of them at least. So let's start by this. There are 23 legs. If I have four, there are 19 left from the 23, 19 is not here. If I have six, so 17 left and 17 is not here. If I have eight, there are 15 left and 15 is here. So I can choose eight from this list and 15 from this list. So eight bipods means, eight legs means four bipods. 15 legs here means five tripods. So the first possible solution here is four bipods and five tripods. Let's complete our list. If I have 10 legs, there are 13 left and 13 is not a multiple of three. If I have a 12, there are 11 left and 11 is not here. If I have 14 from the 23, uh, there will be nine and nine, oh, it is here. So I can choose 14 and nine. 14 legs means seven bipods. Nine legs means three tripods. So the second possible solution here is seven bipods and three tripods. Okay. I will give you a homework. You can check, are there any other solutions for this story or no? There are a toy shop. There is a toy shop. The toy shop stacks, stocks, tricycles, and go cards. The tricycles have three wheels. The, the go cards have five wheels. Our friend Sona counted the wheels. He counted 37 altogether. So when he counted the wheels, he found 37 wheels. He's asking about the number of tricycles and go-karts in this shop. And remember, the tricycle has three wheels. The go-karts has five wheels. Okay? So what I will do, as I learned, my options should be multiples of three and multiples of five. So I will make a list of multiples of three and I'm a list of multiples of five, and I will start checking my options. I have 37. I have to choose two numbers of these, and when I add them, I get 37. So I will think of, for example, uh, nine. How many left from the 37? So there are 28. 28 is not here. What about 12? When I get a 12, when I take away 12 from the 37, I will, there will be 25 remaining. And 25 is already here. So 12 can go with a 25 and they will give me 37 
wheels. 12 means how many tricycles? Four. 25 means five go-karts. So the first possible solution here is four tricycles and five go-karts. And your homework is to find other possible solutions for this story. So to sum up, we learn how to solve problems, making lists and checking our choices. Thank you very much. This was all for today. Bye-bye.